the legislative power established over the government council, where the laws will remain in the part of the people of Sapele local government. I commission this project to the glory of God and to the service of humanity in Jesus' name. The Executive Governor of Delta State, Right Honorable Sheriff Oborowori, has stumped Sapla Local Government Area to commission a host of legacy projects by the Sapla Local Government Chairman, Honorable Eugene Okbe Inwaga. The meritorious works of Inwaga across Sapla Local Government in his two tenure in office has been much documented as the council boss keeps on ranking projects despite his tenure nearing completion in just a few weeks' time. Among projects commissioned include the ultramodern state of the art Sapla Legislative Arm building built from scratch by Inwaga, the Sherman's office building, the Sapler Model Primary School totally reconstructed, construction of Adaribofa Link Road at Amukbe, and the construction of lock-up shops, open market shops, and barricading of the ever-busy Amukbe market. <laughs> Inwaga has proven to be a workaholic council chairman in Sapler. Hence, the executive governor in his speech during the event lauded the quality of the project as they are all up to standard and in line with its more agenda. The project stated and commissioned it today. I'm proud to say that this is money well utilized. <laughs> Chairman have come and gone, but you will stay in this council to a good choice. I commend you, your vice management as well as the legislative arm for a job well done. I'm happy that you did not disappoint your people, the people who elected you. So when we spoke to Saple political leaders, they did not hide their praise for Onwaga, with many describing him as the very best chairman in the history of Sapla local governments, calling for more responsibility to be bestowed on him at the state and federal level, with some even wishing he could do a third tenor in office. He has done very well in every aspect of development. He built a group of schools of global standard, built a market, constructed roads, and a befitting legislative arm. And you can see the massive renovation of the local government secretariat. And so I commend him. I pray for God to give him more promotion and victory as he exits this office. First, uh, we want to appreciate Almighty God on his behalf. Uh, he has proved to us that uh, he was not just only elected as a council chairman, but he has known the reason why he was elected, but he was also doing what is needed by his people. During his electoral uh, campaign, he did promise the people that he's going to bring infrastructure development to his people, and which, of course, we are witnessing today. Yes, the chairman has worked deliciously. He has worked diligently. And uh, we hope uh, people like me will come on board who build on what he has done on the ground. I actually started this government with the chairman because during his uh, election campaign period in 2017, we started it with him. And today, I'm very happy. I don't have any regret of supporting him. What he has done, we pray God to give us a chairman that can surpass his legacy. You see, he has turned the whole place around. He built a modern, befitting legislative arm. He renovated the executive uh, uh, chairman's office. He did a lot of renovation here. He tied roads. He built markets. Security. He did his best. He's, one, he's the best Sapler has ever produced. Honorable Eugene Unwaga, as chairman of Sapler Local Government Council, has done tremendously well. 
even in this where you, in the situation where you have scarcity of funds, where resources are scarce, you still able to do some developments that you cannot that are unparalleled in the annals of the history of Sapley local government area. If you watch all the projects he has embarked on, are projects that have that have impacted the community in infrastructure. I want to commend him for his effort so far at developing the local Sapley local government council. There's a great transformation to the local government chairman. In fact, things that are not there before, through his effort and his tenor, it has made them possible. So I can say for now, this is the best chairman we have had in the local government. Uh, government is continuity. Uh, thank God he, he has uh, been able to do what he has done today. And we are here to celebrate his achievements thus far. Uh, you recall maybe from assumption the, the way he met the council. Uh, the celebration today is about the commissioning of one XYZ project that he's been able to accomplish since his reign as the chairman of the local government. And then we give God the glory. We, we celebrate with him. We join him in thanking the people that elected him also. So we are happy. I'm Comrade Arisin of Bakwe Kelime, the president of Amokwe District. Yes, uh, we feel elated that uh, a local government chairman can embark on this uh, project. The project is particularly important to us because this, this market, a lot of people trading on the streets, women, children running up and vehicle driving everywhere. I can see that it's by the Saple Worry Road and all that. And the local government has really done well. You can see the barricade they put to ensure that it barricaded the women and traders not to go to the to the street to trade, uh, to the road to trade. Rather, it constructed a beefy market and the uh, local shops, open shops, you know, for them to trade. And uh, I commend him because it's not easy for local government government chairman to embark on such project. February 21st, we go down in history as a president in the history of Zabela local government. We have never had it so good. Six years of Honorable Eugene Fuluaga, the chairman of Zabela local government, has brought productivity, development to the people of Zabela and Zabela environment. You, you can see everywhere is a gog. He has executed so many projects and he has, he has worked his way into the heart of all supply residents. It's a laudable one. He has done a wonderful thing and everybody is happy with him. Because whether you like it or not, he has done things that have not been done before. So we need to appreciate him and we need to thank him. So we have given him a pass back. He's done well, he's been fantastic. Um, you know, development is not an easy to bring out development in a in a local government is not easy. It's a grassroots government and it's a bit uh, you know difficult to. Uh, you are in direct contact with the people. It's not an easy exercise. So it's it's done well. I think uh, he has actually finished strong. I should say. Mm. He's a man of honor since the inception of this administration. When he first came in, I was with him when he came in. Even with the capacity of phone, not much phone was available, but he hit the ground running. And from then to now, almost six years, you can see his landmark project, Oliver. Phone is blind, can feel it. Chairman, yes. To assess the chairman is easy because uh, it's about uh, time we begin to pray that people of his life take over the shadow of leadership in Sapele local government. In spite of all odds, the chairman has done very well because uh, when he came on board, it was not as easy as this. 
he was able to transform this council to something that El Dorado of a sort. This place we are sitting now used to be potholes all over. This place was uh, uh, landscaped and interlocked by the chairman of council, Eugene Nwaga. If you look at the environment, you begin to uh, uh, you begin to see an aura of peace and tranquility because you have been able to combat this environment from what it used to be to what it is today. Well, the chairman is one of his kind, a very wonderful chairman. He's a man that has come and he has proven himself to be a leader. And I will, if, you have, if I have the chance, I will want to rate him as the best chairman in Delta State. I want to say he has, uh, he has performed very, very creditably. We have never seen this time in this local government. It's very, very spectacular. I can tell you without missing what he has done so well. Eugene Noah Okpe is an exceptional chairman. He has gone beyond the unthinkable. Inogans showed that he's indeed a man of his words. He has brought infrastructural development, human capital development, more than we, th we thought when we rally around him to become the local government chairman. We never even knew it would get to this level. Eugene has done marvelously okay for the people of Saple. And if I would say, if there is a room for Ted Teno, we will give Eugene the share money. My name is Omate Opebenyo, share lady of the market. Eugene is the best chairman in Saple local government. The building of market is number one. The consulting of road is number one. You see the work that they see. You, we want to say thank you to Eugene. Long life and prosperity over his life. The governor, when he called com commission this place, Governor Sheriff Obowori, we thank Eugene for Governor Obowori. When we say he called commission this market, this Amupa market, this new Amupa market, where they don't know before, Eugene turned out to new modern market, Amupa. I am Abore Henry Akbos, and this is Railroad TV. Thank you for watching.